Alright, well, since we're up here, I kind of want to see if I can go navigate through that cave as the bee. See what's on the other side. That sounds like a good idea to me. Oh. Wait, this is a different cave. Yeah. Wait a minute. Aha! Mmm! Well, that's one eyeball flower. Priceless species, and you're just gonna fill it full of stingers. Yeah, that sounds Shame. awful. They, they know what they did. Really? Wow. See, but that's the great thing about the bee, though. You can just fly right back up. Mm -hmm. Frankly, I'm surprised I didn't take any fall dam damage. You don't take fall damage. You have a cheat code on. Or, you know, suffer a falling animation, whatever. You're, you're right about the fallproof code, though. Not gonna get that trouble, Cliff? I'll come back for it. This is the way I came in. I thought that was the other side. Finally, that was dead. You know, it looks like I should be able uh. to squeeze right in. Yeah, for sure. Oop, nope, nope. So you have to come here just as Kazooie? Hey, no. Saying... This this connects to the other side of the mountain. Yeah, that the uh the thing I I saw while we were flying around the outside of the mountain. With the uh the switch. Okay, so so either could just because we are, are both, because you would need to shoot a clockwork egg in there, right? Yeah, Kazooie needs to be here, is the big thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's go find some more eyeball flowers. Good plan. It's gonna ruin the local ecosystem now. Yep. Wouldn't be the first time video games have made me do that. I think there was one over this way. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I see. Okay, okay. Also, wait a minute. She really isn't the same without her rhyming. It, yeah. Yeah, before we fly off, I do want to just look over here, try to find the hole, because I think there's got to be one. Uh, there it is. Okay, so I think... I think I know enough so that we can go unlock the super safe. Whether or not I can execute on that is a, is a separate problem. I, I believe... Say, I have total faith. <laughs> I believe. I'm gonna tell you that I have total faith anyway. <laughs> you know, I'm kind of impressed I made that shot. I think it's over this way. Yay! I ballus jigium. Another species lost to us forever. Surely Grunty did not have the only ones left in existence. Huh. Okay. 
Okay, that's what I thought. I mean, as we all know, bees are famously just absolutely allergic to cheese. Absolutely, 100%. Can't stand stuff. Uh, is there anything else we particularly want the bee for? Mm. I don't think so. Okay, I'm just gonna take a trip on down. Death warping. Perfect, I actually wanted to be right here. Oh, nice! Frankly, I'm impressed I got that on the first try. I am too! Good job! Okay, can I- can I just like... Try ten digits at this point? No, you have to find the entire combination. I know. Is it, there's a flight pad right there. Oh, was it right here? Yeah, that's because that's where George was. Before you murdered him. Oh, you're right, yeah. you're right. I murdered both members of that marriage couple. Their blood is on your hands, Argent. I think that's just called water? Their water is on your hands. It's okay though, it'll dry off. <laughs> yeah, it'll evaporate. Yeah, we're so high up that I'm not too concerned about having wet hands. You're gonna get caught wet handed. <laughs> Okay, now we gotta hit the thing twice to kill it. There we go. And that's all of them! Woo! 1984. Ah! So, what year is that in, uh, Rare's chronology? Wasn't uh, that the year that that Saber Wolf said he, uh, got imprisoned? Probably... that's probably the year that they... became... no, that, that might be the year of their founding? I don't know, let me see. Cause that was the year that, that, that Saber... Saber Wolf... not Saber Man... Saber Man mentioned. Uh, it was founded- Rare was founded in 1985, so... Huh. Well, Saberman definitely mentioned 1984. That was probably the point at which they were like... That was still when they were like, super play the game, though. Yeah. Alright, well, I'm just gonna... collect this. What are we on the way of totals? Not bad. Yeah, that's actually pretty decent. Mm hmm I mean, I know we're gonna have a page off of- the last page is probably gonna come off of Canary Mary. Mm hmm So is a Jiggy. Um... Alright. We never actually went and checked out that big block of cheese. That seems prudent. There's a... one, two, three? Islands we haven't been to yet? Right, and I've also just remembered Mr. Uh, Mr. Fit has a final challenge for us. He does. This is not the way to Mr. Fit, but there's at least a flight pad. Oh. 
No! Oh boy. Ah, that's unfortunate. Just Rip us. Damn it. Oh well. You're almost there too. I feel like I did basically almost a full lap around uh, the island. And also get to his last challenge from the central cavern I saw entrance yeah I just couldn't remember which entrance it was and there was a flight pad oh, oh neither can I but I'm, <laughs> I know that it is whoops there yeah we've definitely oh, come the, out of the there. last one is the one at the top of that little bit there uh the what one you gotta go up the slope for oh okay well first I don't think it was this one but we'll try it what, Mr. Fit? Yeah. No. Nope, this was, uh... It's got oh, a the flight pad is it's there. Got a flight pad, so that, whatever, that's good enough. Yeah. And this time, you could try going to the right instead of the left. I want to take a look around both ways first, just to make sure. You're the one with the controller! <laughs> There's like a jelly castle thing? behind the fake mumbo house, so we should, we should definitely go check that out. Hey look, an egg! Yeah, so there's the cheese, or we can go to Mr. Fit, you know, the one. D don't hit the slope this time. Try not to. It is, it is not skiing season. No, that was over at uh, Hellfire Peaks. Right. Yeah, I think those are our last four jiggies. Castle, Cheese, Mr. Fit, and Canary Mary. Okay. Okay, Mr. Fit, where is the fucking track this time? Where are we going? It's just sprint. Right here. Jesus, you are fast. Well, they don't, they don't call him Mr. Fit for nothing. I mean, what? Have you not seen him, like, literally run across the entire level? Good point. I feel like I know what those, uh, sprint shoes are for now. Indeed. I'll be back in, uh, just a bit. Once I remember where the shoes are. Well, they have to be close, because you have to be able to just run with them right over to him. Oh, right. They would be, like, right over here, wouldn't they? Yeah, right. Yeah. You got it. Now we can challenge him with our special shoes. Let's do it! I'm feeling a Good little luck. more confident with the, the running shoes. Run! Run for all your worth! Man, you're still- I think the, the I think the jumping is not a good idea, Argit. Yeah, no, I thought it would I thought it would help just if my shoes nope. expire mid-run. I don't think so. I think your problem was you were jumping. Mm. No, jump. Mm -hmm. Just run. You, you were doing fine, and then you jumped and he got ahead of you. Okay. I'm gonna try that again. Camera? If that doesn't work, I might try this with Kazooie by herself, because I think she can get up here. Mr. Fit? No? Oh, they're gonna run out at this point. Or are they? Uh, I think I need to refresh these now. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. That was weird. He knows as soon as he talks to you, you're just gonna beat him. He's trying to delay the inevitable. Okay, maybe you do need to do it as Kazooie then. Yep, yep, this this feels like Kazooie solo. I don't know that um, Kazooie did the running shoes faster. She is so fast without Banjo. Oh, okay. You know what, that's fine. Yeah, it saved you some time. Doesn't hurt to take another look at the pool also. Contemplate the pool. Embrace the pool. Mm -hmm. Consider where you would be in life without the pool. Indeed. Up above, racing Mr. Fit again. All right, let's not say anything we can't take back. Then. <laughs> All right, one more time, Mr. Fit. Let's go. I believe. Alright, go, Kazooie, go! Okay. I didn't know you could just skip the countdown like that. Uh, yeah, it was like Good G, job. R, B or something. Okay. Good job! This, this applied to Banjo-Kazooie as well. You wrecked him. I don't think there's any feathers on Kazooie anymore, Mr. Fit. Uh, excuse me. You would know that if you were following the latest scientific research, that dragons actually did have feathers. It was how they kept themselves warm. <laughs> yes. Uh, you know, I must have missed that article. I'll have to, uh, to, to read up on... Uh, dr uh, yeah. Catch up on Dragons Monthly? It's really exciting, promising research out there, Arcade. I really suggest you take a look at it sometime. Oh yes, cutting edge stuff. Yeah, may maybe after we, uh, finish up here at, uh, Cloud Cuckoo Land, I'll- I'll take a look. See if I can find, uh, the next issue somewhere. That's the spirit. Right. Well, castle is in my line of sight, so let's go there first. Okay. Ah, that sure is a jelly castle. Yep. Why did that hurt? Because beak barge crashing is not falling. I know, but I crashed into jelly. Imagine it still hurts. Huh. Hmm. Don't tell me you're gonna have to try and get solo banjo over there to get in there with the Tiny backpack. There's no way Banjo can make his way over, make his way over here by himself. Well, not with that attitude. Yeah. 
And it's clearly quitter talk. Hurl yourself off the cliff and let's get started. <laughs> okay, first off, I want to know where this takes takes me. Over to fake Mumbo. Got it. It's not that the bee can fit into that, right? No. Okay. Oh, you are intended to get that as banjo. Oh, uh, banjo solo or? Banjo solo. Huh. Okay. All right. Well, before we go find the split pad, I guess let's go hit up the cheese. Smashed face first into sneaky cheese. Oh, oh no. Well, it's stinky in here. This is some very strong cheese. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's uh, it's Swiss. I think this goes a bit beyond Swiss. <laughs> yeah. Ah, too late. Well, no, I got it. And onions, too, huh? Hmm. With spikes on them. Ah. Huh. That is interesting. Oh, there's the Jinjo. Since we're here, what else would we need to do here? Because we already got all the codes. Uh, interesting. Okay, uh, is there actually a Jinjo here, or, or, sorry, a Jiggy, or is it just the Jinjo? There is something here, I'm pretty sure it's a Jiggy. Huh, okay. This is, uh... That's not gonna work. Yeah, I'm gonna pop on out and try to find some holes to, to shoot the clockwork egg through. Maybe up top? Ooh, it bounces. Ew, squishy. Ugh. I felt like that. It's uh, not how your cheese should look. No, it's 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 very moldy. Yeah, this kind of cheese is usually pretty firm. If it's bouncy like this, uh, maybe just throw it out. Not to mention the mold. <laughs> that too. Like there, there's a trash can. Uh, right nearby. I think it's on the other side of the mountain, actually. Do these tunnels actually go? Is my question. Not far at all. That's the end. Huh. So what's here? Are you supposed to get or er, okay? 
Okay, well that's the end. Looking over here. I'm confused. Do I need to like climb on the are, onions? I think you are fundamentally misunderstanding what you are supposed to do. I yeah, I think I probably am. Oh, I see the jiggy. Oh. Yeah, there's the jiggy. Okay, well, setting fire to the onions is not the answer. I don't think that's gonna work either. I'm gonna go restock up on arrows then. Air. Right, I don't know why I said arrows. Because you got Zelda on the brain. Clearly. What I meant to say was feathers. Oh. Well, arrows have feathers at the end of them. This is probably gonna hurt, but yep. Can't really grab onto those either. Forget you already know what's up there. Yeah, the jiggy's up there. Is there another clockwork tunnel to go through? Right, it's a clockwork tunnel. So even if you could get up there, you can't do anything. You know what? That, yeah, yeah, got it. Just go. Yeah, I'm. I am not getting this one right now.